Hi, I'm Professor Rotham, and today's video is about how to execute a command as another user with sudo. Typically, we use sudo to execute commands that only root has permission to run, but it serves to execute commands as any user. For example, the function to add a user to the system may only be executed by a user with administrative privileges, like root. Let's try to execute it with current user student. By the way, who am I shows current user student. Now let's do add user, user01. The answer is only root may add a user group to the system. To know if user student may execute add user as root with sudo, let's type sudo minus l. Notice that sometimes it asks user student's password. This time it didn't. The answer is the default entry for user student in Ubuntu and user student may run following commands in Ubuntu. All commands as all users and all groups, including root. This is in slash etc slash sudoers, sudo configuration file. So let's type cat slash etc slash sudoers so that we may see its contents. We have no permission for it, so we must use sudo even to see the configuration file, and there it is. Now we are 100% sure we may add a user with sudo add user user01. It, it really did add the user. Now it's asking for the password. I may type any password, some information about the user, and the user is added. I am student, but I executed the comment as root. In fact, we may execute any command as any user. To execute a command as another user, other than root, option minus u followed by username must be used. Let's try to see contents of user guest directory. ls minus l slash home slash guest. We cannot open directory because we have no permission for it. So let's type sudo minus u guest ls minus l slash home slash guest. And now we may see the contents of this directory because now we are, we are acting as guest user, not as student user. Further details may be seen in sudo manual page with man sudo. Well, that's all. See you in next videos. Bye-bye.